Miami. First at 11, Lyle and Eric Menendez could be close to freedom. The brothers were convicted of murdering their parents in one of the most famous murder trials of the 20th century. The Los Angeles District Attorney is recommending a judge resentence the Menendez brothers. If that happens, the brothers could be freed after spending 35 years locked up. CBS News Miami's Anna McAllister has today's dramatic developments and the family's connection to South Florida. New evidence of sexual, physical, and emotional abuse at the hands of Eric and Lyle Menendez's father, Jose, is coming to light after it was excluded from their original trial. And testimony from a former Latin boy band member could play a critical role in the brothers' potential release. After more than three decades behind bars, the Menendez brothers have a shot at freedom. I believe that they have paid their debt to society. And I do believe that the brothers were subjected to a tremendous amount of dysfunction in the home and molestation. Lyle and Eric Menendez were convicted of gunning down their parents, Jose and Kitty Menendez, back in 1989 when they were just 21 and 18 years old. During their televised trial, the brothers said they shot and killed their parents after experiencing severe abuse during their childhood, including sexual abuse at the hands of their father, Jose. Last year, Roy Rossello of the boy band Menudo claimed he was raped in the 1980s by Jose Menendez, who was an entertainment executive. Yo estuve una semana con un dolor terrible. The brothers have said for decades that their father often threatened them and they feared for their lives. He had promised their whole life that if they ever told the family secret, he would kill them, their brother, and their mother. We spoke to Nari Inclan, who produced the documentary Menendez and Menudo, Boys Betrayed. She talked to Lyle just last week. For the first time in decades, he has a little glimmer of hope that, you know, he may be with his family. Jose Menendez was originally from Cuba. He had plans to move his family to Miami and to get into politics. Relatives on both sides of the Menendez brothers' family have expressed support for their release. Lyle and Eric have already paid a heavy price, discarded by a system that failed to recognize their pain. They have grown, they have changed, and they have become better men despite everything that they've been through. This step gives us all hope that the truth will finally be heard and that Lyle and Eric can begin to heal from the trauma of their past. And tomorrow, the Los Angeles DA will file paperwork to recommend a resentencing. And if a judge does agree to that, then it would go before a parole board to determine if the brothers will be released. But for now, reporting from Miami, Adam McAllister, CBS News, Miami.